Yes, a real adventure. Montana is one of my favorite places to visit. Not only because I have some of my best friends there, but also because it's one of the most beautiful places that I've ever been. You have Glacier National Park, which is unbelievable. You can walk off into many different places in Montana and never see another person. It's probably one of the last places in the continental United States that you can do that. And because of that, it always calls my name. So, so, we're on our way to East Glacier. It's dumping snow. Andrea's driving. We're going to West Glacier. I don't know where we're going. If you're in the backseat, you almost never know where you're actually going. So, we'll go to a glacier. <laughs> Andrea! What? Where are we? Uh, next to Glacier National Park. Actually, this is Glacier National Park. Thank you. I just finished packing up, heading on a two day camping trip to East Glacier with Alex Scholl and RJ Bruni. Um, as you can see, I'm pretty heavily loaded right now. Uh, it's kind of semi-car camping, but there's some skinny involved, but not too far, so it shouldn't be too hard. It should be fun. See you guys there. Troll, who has my tripod plate? <laughs> Always stealing my shit. That's our dick. Say something funnier. <laughs> so we pulled away, and then we pulled right back in because I am a fucking idiot. Now we can leave. Currently, me and Stroll are deciding what we're gonna have for dinner. Stroll, what do you think we're gonna have for dinner? Well, we can have a debate, or we can just buy couscous. Couscous. It's so easy. Okay, so we stopped on the side of the road to have dinner, and there's Stroll over there cooking some couscous. Oh, it's brewing. It's brewing? Uh -huh. Brewing. Steeping. And we're at a really fancy rest stop. They used Mr. Plow and just went by. Yeah, it was a lovely scenic plow that just drove by. Really loud. Yeah, keeping it real. Uh, Check back in when the couscous is oh. done. Do you want an apple? No, I don't want an apple. I got my cookie. <laughs> and yeah, you enjoy your apple. No. I'm gonna enjoy my 12 chocolate chip cookies. There's like 14 of them. Maybe. Maybe yeah, we get. So maybe. Maybe we got two extras. Go away. Don't you dare. <laughs> don't you dare steal my cookies. So we finally got to our campsite, and. It's in a parking lot. Almost bedtime. Just doing some last minute snow boiling. It's kinda cold. It's definitely a windy night. I would say the winds were gusting at maybe 25, 30 miles an hour. The um at one point, I think I lifted up like, two inches off the ground. It's pretty fun. So we're at Teton Pass Ski Resort in Montana. It's a pretty amazing resort. It has only one lift, but has tons of like kind of backcountry, side country terrain that it's pretty epic. So we're gonna skin it. And I um, met the general manager, he's an awesome guy. 
So if you're ever in Montana and want a cool resort that's a hometown feel, go to Teton Pass. It gets my stamp of approval. Time to begin the skin. Whoa! Stroll just threw a snowball at me. So, we just finished skinning up Teton Pass Resort. Let's stroll right over there. It's, uh, it's windy, it's good. It's windy, yeah, it's very windy. Beauty though. But it's beautiful up here. Yeah. We decided to go for another skin. I'm tired, but here we go. So I totally forgot to film on the way down because I was... We're filming. <laughs> huh? I totally forgot to film with this camera on the way down because I was using the Mavic drone. And uh, maybe, that put, maybe that yeah, maybe that footage turns out. Yeah, I crashed it into a tree once. Then I almost crashed it again into a tree. Different trees though, so it's not really my fault. It's just, it's, it's Mother Nature's fault for putting trees in my way. <laughs> <laughs> the time has come where I have to leave Montana and head back to Seattle. So, I'm leaving. Sad. It's always sad when I have to leave Montana. I'm always counting the days until I get to go back. I hope this time is not too long. Anyway. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I've got another one coming up soon. Thanks.